Hello, everyone. Are you looking for a client to connect to DataBend? In this video, we will demonstrate three options for connecting to DataBend, so you can choose the method that works best for you. Before we start, let's start up a local DataBend first. To do so, just navigate to the DataBend folder and type slash script slash start.sh. Here you go. DataBend is running now. First option, connecting with DataBend's native command line interface, Ben SQL. This allows you to easily connect to DataBend and query data from a terminal. To connect to the local DataBend, simple type Ben SQL. Easy? That's the beauty of using Ben SQL. Second option, connecting with MySQL driver. If you prefer a popular database management tool like dBeaver, you can easily connect to DataBend using the MySQL driver. When you create a connection to the local DataBend, simple change the port to 3307, then test the connection. Third option, connecting with DataBend's JDBC driver. You can also connect to DataBend using the DataBend's JDBC driver, which can be added to your MySQL client such as dBeaver. To do so, first open the driver manager, then click New to create a new driver. On the Settings tab, enter the required information for the new driver. On the Libraries tab, click Add Artifact, then copy and paste the dependency declaration to the text box. You can find the parameter values and dependency declaration code in the description part of this video. Now the new driver is all set. To create a connection to the local data band, first select the new driver you created, then test the connection.